Hey there, Kenneth G. Hasty here once again. Today's video is called Mouse in My Pocket. <laughs> I know, right? What a name for a video, but it seems appropriate. So <clears throat> today's video talks about saying things without actually saying it, or in closing, I call those ghost closes. So let's talk about it a little bit. You know, <clears throat> for instance, if, you know, somebody... In, in kind of slang or just in general, people trying to be cool, you know, uh, be like, um, if there's something that, you know, let's say they're we, you know, we say we want to do this or we want to do that. Hey, let's go do this. Or, you know, we, we, we can do this or, you know, and, and one way to reject that without actually rejecting it, and somebody's probably done this to you in the past, say, what do you got, a mouse in your pocket? <laughs> so, in other words, they're not in. You know, it's like, well, I'm not doing it. You got a mouse in your pocket? That's your we, you know. Or um, <clears throat> another thing is like when somebody wants to say something's undisputable, you know, then rather than just say that, they just look at it like, does a bear shit in the woods? And that's, of course, what I like to say, well, not a polar bear, you know, but <laughs> that's a different thing. But anyway, when it comes to uh, saying things without saying them, you do the same thing or you can with closing sales or what I call ghost closes. So, Let's say, for instance, um, somebody is envisioning buying a car, so they're convertible, right? So they're talking to the car dealer, and um, they're they're saying, you know, and, they, and so you start having that conversation. Say, yeah, wouldn't it be great to have that new convertible, and then you can drive down that uh, um, Highway One in California and just enjoy the sunshine and the smell the ocean and the nature, and you know, stop at my favorite little milkshake stand, have that strawberry milkshake, and, you know, that, that, okay. So what the car salesperson might do, you know, a lot of car salespeople would do a summary close, and they're like, well, we've agreed that this car, blah, 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 and they, you fall asleep while they're talking there. But a real easy close, a you know, ghost close, is just to say, well, you ready to go get that milkshake? You know, um, because by the time they've got the milkshake, that means they had to already have purchased the car, right? So um, it's a way to say it, but it's non non-threatening. Right? Let's say um, somebody's at a jewelry store right? and they're talking about their, my, my, my spouse would really like this and, you know, probably love it actually, you know, then might even start feeling amorous, you know, pop the champagne and, you know, you know where I'm going from there, right? Okay. So now the salesperson can close and try to say, well, would you like to buy this beautiful piece of jewelry, blah, 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 or they, but a real good way to do it is say, well, what do you think? Are they ready to pop that champagne? And so you're saying it without saying it. it's a ghost close. So anyway, I just thought I'd bring that up today. Uh, you know, you don't have to hard close people when you're talking about things. You can make it a nature of the conversation and just, you know, just make it kind of assumed by, by doing it that way. I, th I think my favorite close just in general one, you know, because really if you, if you set up your sales conversation, you're talking to the right person with the right thing at the right time, the close should just be a natural progression. It shouldn't be this big, you know, okay, this big event, right? So you, my, my favorite one is just I'll look at somebody and say, well, <clears throat> okay, you ready to do it? Let's do it. You know, and so everything we've talked to up to that point should take them there. Anyway, so that's all I've got for today. Kenneth G. Hasty here signing off. I'm the guy you call when you get serious about turning your business into a big business. You can check me out my website at KennethGHasty.com. You can email me, Kenneth, at KennethGHasty.com. Or if you want to talk some business, you know, we help you work on your business instead of in your business and we, we can handle uh, virtually anything the sales marketing the systems etc so if you want to talk about how we can do that and help you be a little more uh, focused on your business and make you know growing that business and instead of the detail stuff give us a talk or if you need us to uh, come out and talk to your sales team do sales meetings we'll do that too so this is kenneth g hasty signing off so uh just remember not a polar bear <laughs> i'll talk to you later bye